going into the school year, we're really, really, really excited for basketball season to start. There is a tremendous amount of excitement, not only on our campus, but in the state of Rhode Island, but I'll say, you know, nationally. Rhode Island is, is, is on the map. I think uh, the, the credibility that, that Dan brings to the, to the table, along with his staff, has really uh, brought us to a next level without even playing a game. Obviously, we're so excited to have Coach Hurley and his staff uh, here leading our men's basketball program. Uh, Dan's been uh, been active and energized and engaged in the in the entire community ever since the first day he set foot on campus and there's just a tremendous amount of excitement and when you bring in a new coach you have to start sitting back and spending some time with that individual and say what are some things we need to help you with what are some things we need to work on and you know Dan had a good vision and a, and a solid plan that, that, that he provided with me that, that we worked on together and we'll continue to work on together to figure out what do we do to put ourselves in the best position to compete in the Atlantic 10, especially now with adding two great schools like Butler and VCU. So those areas consisted of making sure we had solid academic support and, and we do that and we do have that in place. Uh, also some facility upgrades. You know, we need to make sure, and Coach felt very, very strongly, that we needed to, to take our locker room and make that a place that the players felt very, very comfortable. That was home. He demands so much of them in the classroom and, uh, and on the court that he wants to have a, a place where they can go back to and relax, watch film, and just kind of hang out when they need to. And, and so we were really excited that over the past two months, Three months, we went out and raised about $150,000 very quickly from about eight or nine people that allowed us to go in and, and start a, a locker room renovation project that's taking place and, and ultimately will be completed around October 15th, right before the start of the school year. So that's just phase one, I'll call it, of, of some of the things that we need to do around that program. We're going we're gonna to raise some money to do some renovations about around the men's and women's basketball uh, offices so that when we're competing to, uh, and recruiting against the very, very best programs in the country, when you walk into uh, the Ryan Center, which is a spectacular facility, we also have a lot of the other buzz, that I'll call it, that, um, that we need to do in order to help encourage these young people to make the decision to come to the University of Rhode Island and compete. It's really important for me to, to thank so many people that were involved with the fundraising initiative around the locker room renovation and then also uh, really want to encourage people to get behind helping us raise the dollars needed for the, for the other projects that, that are going to come our way. We have got to, to have our men's basketball program and women's basketball program compete at the highest level in the A-10 and in doing that we can bring great exposure and, and, and tremendous amount of excitement to the entire institution.